Hello everyone, welcome back to BPO Interview Tutorials and I hope you guys have seen our playlist uh, wherein you will find multiple videos related to Google Data Studio, people management, tutorials on the trainers, quality analyst job role, 7 quality tools, excel tips and tricks, 6 sigma certifications, many more are there. So I would like everyone please go to BPO Interview Tutorials and click on subscribe option. You will find it here along with the bell icon guys please please do that so that you will get all the notification on the upcoming videos guys okay let's start today's concept uh, which we are discussing on the local studio or else data studio earlier I already pasted two videos on it guys I would like everyone please do check this you will get all the information about Google data studio why we are using it so here basically related to our work we are using it for creating the dashboards and report with the help of google sheet wherein i have my data into it okay this is my entire data which is available in the google sheet so let's start uh, with the uh, the new concept so today we will uh, prepare the uh, blueprint of the dashboard i can say like uh, the view of the dashboard first of all i will insert the text on the top of the header you guys can see uh, the option of text here you need to click on this okay you just need to uh, just keep the place wherever you want the information so i want the title as quality dashboard quality dashboard uh, 2022 or oh, it's almost 2023 i know but still here in the right uh, in the right side you guys can see the option of properties you can increase the size as well at whatever size you require it's up to you guys okay so you can increase the size you can change the alignment also okay you can change the alignment as well you can keep it centered you can give border to it okay so let me increase the size uh, to 44 I guess this will look good yes I gave the size of 44 I'll give a background as well guys because it's just a header for me and here you can also change the font so it's easy to change the font guys I'll just keep the font as uh, okay there are many font you can see guys okay I'll just keep the basic font and let let give the border also so if you scroll down you'll find the option of background so i'll keep the background as blue color yes it's done you can also give the border guys i'll keep the uh, border as black i hope this is very much easy uh, to add the text in the dashboard so i'll just uh, resize it okay some answer if i if i click on view right you will get a uh, the view of this dashboard how this will look like so hope this this is very easy to do that 